I have with me Deepak uh, Mishra. Deepak has done our certificate program in quantitative finance and risk management. Deepak is currently based in UK. He has more than 15 plus years of experience in developing software products for the domains of capital market, wealth management, life and pension, pension insurance, wrap products, and payments. So thank you so much, Deepak, for joining it. It's always a pleasure to have you. Uh, thanks, Nitish, uh, for this wonderful opportunity uh, uh, to give uh, feedback about uh, or to uh, share my experience of, uh, of being a part of the IIQF family uh, and the uh, uh, about the certificate program and the quantitative finance and risk management. Uh, it's it's truly a privilege to do it. Uh, to, just to start with uh, a bit about myself. Uh, sure. So I, I have been uh, in uh, the other side of the world. Uh, not in the uh, the usual finance side, but more from the uh, software development, uh, which is uh, so I've right. I've been developing uh, uh, software products for the uh, the domains of capital market wealth management, uh, and have got uh, some insights about the investment management. So uh, uh, it's and I've uh, worked with uh, you know uh, multinational organizations like Tata Consultancy and Services. But currently, I'm working for a startup which is more into the um, new trends of open banking and you know uh, PST to payment sector. So right. we're kind of trying to establish uh, an infrastructure uh, for all the non-financial, uh, non-traditional, non-financial uh, organizations to access the bank banking data and provide better service to the customers. Uh, so right. that, that's that's a bit about myself. Right. Thank you. Thank you so much uh, uh, for the for the brief introduction. Uh, I mean, uh, we would like to hear about from you is uh, uh, briefly about the course. Of course, uh, the course that you have done the certificate program in quantitative finance and risk management. But what we'd also like to know is uh, why you chose this course. Yeah, sure. I'll be. Uh, so I mean, uh, the reason uh, I had a couple of reasons to be honest uh, before I ventured into uh, going for this course uh, so one of the more uh, one of the key reasons which i would say is you know uh, i looked at the syllabus of iiqf and i felt i felt i felt that this is a very thoughtfully uh, curated syllabus it has got a very thoughtfully curated syllabus uh, covering the different topics of investment uh, financial mathematics and as well as uh, getting into the latest trends of machine learning you know we all know there's this uh, huge buzzword about machine learning, data science. Uh, so this, I I felt this uh, still, uh, course kind of covered all the uh, different niche things which I was looking for. Uh, so I you I mean basically uh, I've been uh, in the non uh, uh, financial aspect of being in the software. So I've been on the other side of the fence. Right. So uh, but if we look at it, there's a, there's been a shift. So from the usual uh, traditional investment managers, right? So now there's been a shift wherein people, uh, even folks who are purely into finance uh, and all are picking up the software skills of Python and everything. So that Absolutely. kind of prompted me that when they are getting into the software world, as a software, as being a software ex uh, professional, shouldn't I as well try to gain some insights about their world and you know learn, pick up their trade secrets? So uh, that was that was one of the uh, reasons which prompted me, and uh, you know, uh, so I was looking for different sort of uh, certifications as well. So the the thought is, if I do pick a bit, because now with the land uh, changing landscape in the professional world, you know, uh, it could be a possibility with so much of uh, experience in the software world and uh, enhancing my knowledge about the investment world. There could be a new role and i might get a change in the role which i would love to pursue so i just wanted to be ready for it and so that that's something you know uh, was the idea or the thought i had behind in pursuing uh, such a course so i was on a lookout what what could be the best suitable things so i did uh, go around and you know see saw some options the traditional road programs of uh, cfa and frms and all but they're they're quite a long duration program so i mean 
but my thought was to get some insight into it and the other bit being uh, in this professional world you know uh, it's again we are not i am not uh, just from uh, uh, in the college uh, or this past out of college so it's i i was looking for more non traditional way of learning so the, i i felt at this point in my career it didn't seem right that i go learn from the books get and do it on my experience learn from my mistakes when i can spend some time getting the knowledge uh, and learning from the experience of all the seasoned veterans who are you know uh, delivering this program so uh, that that was kind of the thought which i had that and when i looked at the syllabus it covered all the things which i was looking for uh, i felt this is the right word uh, right uh, program for me and so i kind of you know enrolled for it wonderful wonderful if you can actually share a little bit more about your experience with us at iqf if you can actually share experience with us at iqf uh i mean to uh to brief me out my experience with i iqf and the program uh, was uh, much more than what i expected uh being you in usually the kind of uh, you know uh, of the corporate trainings and such programs they they usually quite monotonous and all but uh, you have to be you have to be on your toes uh, or you know do a lot of off the program work to pick up what it is but my uh, the thing about for me is like for instance iiqf uh, gave you the preparatory materials for people, uh, any, for any folks who do not have experience in python or who want to refresh their understanding of maths so they gave all the initial primer to go along with it uh, but even then uh, <clears throat> they were in, in the initial classes the faculties used to just brush it up so that you know everyone if they had and have an had an opportunity to go through those primers they would not be uh, kind of baffled and you know left uh, confused for uh, during the session uh so that that was uh, quite nice uh, i would say uh, uh, about the faculty is doing it you know they they took it up to themselves to do it uh the other bit as i have I already iterated the syllabus i feel it's very well structured and and an informative syllabus uh so it's and it's it kind of touches all the key areas and you know the experience of the faculty so the and the faculties are so good uh, so just apart from you know skimming through the syllabus they ensure that they kind of deliver and make us understand the fundamentals of it you know the fundamentals of the uh, the the mathematics which are involved in different models rather than just explaining that these are the different parameters of a model you know and go about it so so that that was it. but for me uh, the plus point are probably i would say is a kind of a free bonus uh, apart from all the quiet learning uh, which the program already offers the kind of a free uh, unknown package or a bonus for me is that all the experience that our uh, fabulous faculty shared you know so listening to their experience uh, of the investment world uh, all the uh, and their and their knowledge about it you know it, it just gives a totally new insight so uh, to be honest i i i didn't have this experience that is what i was lacking but hearing them out i would just probably spend uh, a weekend with them if it is possible to understand more and hear their experience more yeah, wonderful surely we will definitely take that suggestion and like uh, we would see how we can connect you more to the faculties there always any way available in case you are like uh, stuck anywhere or like you are having any doubt Uh, not only during the program but uh, later on also of course we are always happy to help thank you but, uh, it's 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 really nice to know that you have uh, liked and you found the program useful yeah uh, so finally uh, since you, you you have so much of experience yourself uh, again there are a lot of people uh, from the software background and both from the uh, in the finance background who wants to enter into this field of who want to do finance risk management and all these areas right so maybe some thoughts uh, your recommendation and suggestions for those aspirants who want to enter into this field 
Yeah, uh, I mean, absolutely. Uh, in in my view, uh, as since I was not from uh, the usual finance background, and I had uh, kind of gained a limited knowledge about the financial world. For me, it was uh, a, a really good program to explore more about the financial world. Uh, but that said, you know, I, I did I do I did have fellow batchmates who are experienced individuals uh, in the financial world. So my thought about the program is, as a, as a non-financial person with a, a different background, uh, it definitely adds on value to it. Okay, it'll, uh, you, you'll uh, an individual, uh, a participant will definitely pick up a new insights by interacting with our uh, industry veterans uh, who deliver this pro program. Uh, but again, just thinking about all the fellow batchmates which I have who are there in this. Uh, financial world for a long um, for quite some time i think the added advantage for them uh, based on our interactions i felt is though they are there the they got a lot to learn because this program you know it the, as i said it covers it from the fundamentally the faculty is very keen to ensure that you understand the fundamentals of it you know rather than kind of just skimming through it and as well as uh, how all the fundamentals of financial world can be applied with the new latest trends of machine learning and if, uh, all the different models of the machine learning. So those bits, I feel, I, I uh, based on my interaction with my fellow batchmates who are in the financial world, so uh, they did have a quite a good in, uh, understanding and insight of with and learning from these uh, things. So in my view, uh, be, uh, if you are from a software world like me or a financial world there is something which the program uh, can uh, you can learn from it you can pick it uh, pick it up so uh, and you know uh, for me I, I just ventured into it to understand more it because i'm kind of uh, a bit of you know quite inspired by the steve uh, jobs uh, code uh, when he uh, told in one of the interview that you can only connect uh, things when you look backward so you have to just trust the dots uh, will somehow connect in your future. So I'm sure that being in this program, understanding this, I'm quite ready. So when the role comes for me as a software developer, I uh, if if the if there's a new role which comes up with a changing la uh, professional landscape, I'll be ready uh, to pounce on it and grab it. So that that's my uh, kind of uh, recommendations. So keep yourself open. Uh, enjoy every moment. The faculty is fabulous. Keep it interactive. They love to be very interactive. You know, uh, ask questions and uh, just share their experience out. That, that's a wonderful thing to do. Thank you. Thank you so much. Uh, really a pleasure to have you. Thank you so much once again for joining in and uh, enjoy the rest of the Sunday. Thanks, Nitish. The pleasure is mine.